Support Wrestle Talk. Give us a subscribe. Hello and welcome to the Wrestle Talk News. I. I'm Luke Owen. I think most people were really surprised when 205 Live act Lucha House Party made a random appearance on last night's Raw and they beat the Revival in a short match. However, perhaps it was just there for Corey Graves to make some of his hilarious jokes. Sadly for Graves, one of his jokes was stepped on by fellow color commentator Renee Young, which means he didn't actually give the punchline for why Kalisto's mum cried for three days after giving birth to him, but praise Jeebus for Twitter, where Graves revealed the punchline was because she couldn't believe she created something so ugly. For more bad jokes, I recommend the Wrestle Ramble podcast, where listeners are sending in their own. Like this one from Connor Kiran. What do you call a dinosaur that looks after his teeth? A flossiraptor. Flo- flossirap- flossiraptor. You know, like flossing. Flo- floss it, floss- and I forget it. But that's enough jokes for now. Time for some serious news. It was reported last week by Robbie Fox of Barstool Sports that John Cena wanted to pull out of WWE's controversial Crown Jewel show, which takes place this Friday from Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. Dave Meltzer first reported that several big names on the show were unhappy about working Crown Jewel, especially after it was confirmed that the Saudi government murdered Washington Post journalist Jamal Khashoggi for writing critical things about them. Despite these reports, Cena was still being heavily advertised to be part of their World Cup tournament, but that has all now changed. It was announced on last night's Raw by Baron Corbin that Cena was being pulled from the tournament to be replaced with Bobby Lashley, presumably to keep that mid-2000s feel about it. And Lashley's first round opponent has been revealed along with the rest of the brackets. Lashley will face Seth Rollins, while Dolph Ziggler will take on Kurt Angle on the Raw side, with Rey Mysterio versus Randy Orton and Jeff Hardy versus The Miz taking place on the SmackDown side. That tournament will join Brock Lesnar versus Braun Strowman for the vacant Universal Championship, Championship, D-Generation X vs Brothers of Destruction, and Daniel Bryan taking on AJ Styles for the WWE Championship. However, according to some new reports, that match could also be in jeopardy. Robbie Fox also reported, along with Cena, that Daniel Bryan was unhappy about being part of Crown Jewel, and that he has the backstage clout to refuse to work the show. And now PW Insider have reported that Bryan could be a question mark for Crown Jewel, with Mike Johnson writing, there's also been talk that Daniel Bryan has also pulled out of the show. Johnson adds that if Brian has indeed pulled out of Crown Jewel, WWE will need to either shoot an angle on tonight's episode of SmackDown Live to change the match this Friday, or they've already filmed something in advance of the show. Which certainly makes WWE's announcement on Twitter that Brian and Stars will have a segment on tonight's episode of SmackDown Live very interesting. For what it's worth, the Wrestling Observer's Dave Meltzer has reported they've had no confirmation from anyone that Brian has officially pulled out of Crown Jewel. And Wrestling Inc. recently noted that WWE have taken out new online adverts to promote the WWE championship match. But as we said earlier, WWE were promoting John Cena for the World Cup, up to and including the first hour of last night's Raw. And Robbie Fox added on Twitter, the plan is for AJ Styles' Daniel Bryan to be advertised as if it's happening right up until the event, but Bryan will not be there. Some sort of pre-tape is being discussed now. Watch Ollie Davis' review of Monday Night Raw in about four minutes by clicking the video on screen right now. And get your tickets to see Wrestle Ramble live in London by clicking the image of Terry Funk. I've been Luke Owen, and that was wrestling.